Projects done poorly for five dollars. So Star Trek is dead. Saying Picard is good is like watching a reanimated corpse dance. Just put it back in the corpse. I don't mind if you watched Picard and you're like, I hated it. That's fine. What I don't like is I didn't see it and you shouldn't like the thing you watched that you did like. That I don't understand. Yep. That's my only gripe is is fucking, not only that, if I'm like, nah, this season wasn't woke. And they're like, no, it was. And it's like, did you watch any of it? And they're like, no. And it's, yeah. like, and it's like, wait a minute. So you know better than me and you didn't watch. And yes, I know better than you. That, well, that's, that's why, like, like we know that um, like, like certain we, movies suck. Like when we were watching Marvel and we're like, oh, or The Last Jedi, we watched that and we're like, this shit fucking sucks. Yeah, we all know what woke is. And they're like, well, this thing happened in season one. I'm like, didn't watch it. This happened in season two. Didn't watch it. I'm saying I only watched season three. They went out of their way not to make it woke. I would even say it's anti-woke. Because the whole fucking thing is about people under 25 getting groupthink, you know what I mean? And the older people being able to fucking resist it. And it's almost an anti-woke message of like fucking, you know, the, the dangers of groupthink. But um, no, people are just like, no, 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 I, it, you don't know what you're talking about. I didn't see it, but you're wrong. I'm like, how do I fucking argue? That's retarded. Donovan, do you even watch Star Trek or? No, I uh, get pussy. Actually. That's <laughs> what I do. Ah. So, that's why you're wrong to me. Well, thank you, poor uh, projects done poorly. If you watched it and say no, I'm wrong. Yeah, it was totally fucking woke. That's fine. That's a then you have a legit uh, argument. If you're like, no, you watched it, but you were too dumb to notice. It's like, okay. No, but I, I did hear people say that it was good that I like. It was good. Like, I didn't want, listen. I already was. I wasn't gonna watch it. But yeah, who would you hear talk about it? Uh, just a lot of people in group chats that like, you know, they, every time they see something new as a collective, they come in the group chat and they're like, hey, this was pretty good. They're like, oh, this was dog shit. And uh, they were talking about season three being actually pretty good. But I don't know. I didn't, they don't really Star Trek. Or Star Wars. Really Star Trek. I like Star Wars. That's my thing. You like Baby Yoda? Yeah, I would fuck it. I'd fuck the shit out of the Baby Yoda, dude. No, not the baby. He's baby Yoda. It's time. Baby Yoda's 50. I wouldn't fuck a 50. Yeah, old. why? Leave him alone. He looks good for 50. He's a baby. <laughs> nice he and cool. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this makes me think of like the <laughs> Wally fit where they're like, oh, it looks like a seven year old child, but it's a thousand year old shark girl. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like that Wally shit, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> he looks good for 50s. He does. Looking good, baby Yoda. Oh, my God. 200 watt studio. Cecil, why can't stay in the cult and think like we do like we tell you how dare you have a mind of your own the gall of you i'm sorry it was good like i don't know i'm just getting i'm just like i'm just getting i don't really care if people liked watched it and didn't like it that's fine but when people didn't watch it and are telling me i'm wrong i'm like I don't fucking understand. It also says that you have no trust in my judgment whatsoever. Like I could not p figure out woke shit. Like, like we haven't been talking about woke shit for the last five years and we're not hyper sensitive to it and are completely in tune to it. Yeah. And they're like, no, no, you missed it. And I'm like, which part did I miss? And they're like, I don't know. I didn't watch it. <laughs> like, okay. It's a the fucking one clip that's getting spread around. You missed yeah. that part. Duh. What, what's that? You, you miss the one part that goes viral that everybody takes out of context. And, mm -hmm. you know, it's the one reason why the show is bad. Because I have this opinion. Yeah, I also I think, know. like, I'm helping save the show. Like, I didn't watch any of the new Star Trek at all. I didn't even watch this until, like, the fourth show. And it's because Anna, Flash, Gary, people whose opinion I trust on the matter, who are also very sensitive to woke shit, were like, no, it's not woke. But I had no plans on watching it. In fact, I was fucking railing against it. I was like, don't watch it. It's going to be woke. 
And people were like, no, you're wrong. So I fucking gave it a shot. It was good. I actually enjoyed it. And people are mad that I enjoyed something. I'm like, why is it fucking bothering you that somebody watched something and liked it? See, that was uh, me with the new Top Gun. Because I, I just didn't, like, I'm not a big Top Gun fan. I don't hate it. It just wasn't in my watch growing up, you know? But I heard everybody say that the new one was fantastic. And I finally got it around to watching it and yeah it was good it was all right i liked it i didn't think it was amazing but i liked it i watched uh i think it was a parody i was very different when i thought it was called bottom gun mm -hmm. um mm -hmm. it was all male cast okay it was uh military based right. but they really never left the barracks in this particular film it was good were there a lot of like uh shots in that one like a lot of there was a volleyball game Okay, so they kept that in there. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, the shorts were smaller, and the dicks were bigger. I'm sorry. What was that last thing you said? <laughs> the stakes were higher. Okay, that's what I thought. I think. What What's worse? New Star Wars or New Star Trek? I guess. I guess. In sheer numbers, I guess New Star Trek is. I guess they're pretty much even because I guess there was like a, a season or two of Mandalorian that were kind of fun. And there was one season of Picard and everything else. Is there anything in New Trek that's worth watching, Anna? Aside from Picard, the no. Th what about the first two seasons? Absolute Wait. trash. And uh, Discovery. What's the other one? Brave New Worlds. Did you ever look at that? I didn't watch that one. I saw like a scene where you know how like Nurse Chapel always had a crush on Spock, yes. and so they made the villain of the episode hit like to bring his his wife betrothed chick, and then he but he has to convince her, like because he's like oh no your marriage didn't work out with that one guy, or something, and so he's just like oh uh, no I'm actually in love with someone else, and she's like I don't believe you, and so he makes out with Nurse Chapel, and it's like this is so cringy. He's logical. He would explain that I do not want to be with your mate, and then she'd be like, "I understand." They're fucking Vulcans. They don't. You don't have to I do know. all this. I know. Um. Wait. So this is after. The, what is it called? No, it's before. Uh, it? I don't. I'd have. I don't want to watch it again. But I watched it the one time, and that chick was the bad guy in the episode. <sighs> yes, yeah, Fox ex-wife. Or, or ex wife yet because they haven't done that ceremony because he's not with Kirk yet because it's still Pike. So, again, these are people that don't watch Star Trek writing Star Trek. That's awesome. Uh, mm -hmm. Casey, going in blind on to Star Trek, I watch Picard because of you guys and my dad. Season three is amazing. Thank you. That's it. Like, it's not the greatest thing ever, but it was fun. It was like we haven't got you know see the cast and there was no woke in it. Like it was. It was fine. There was no, there was no, they're like, yeah, but that other girl and her was her girlfriend. It's like, and how would I know that if I just watched season three? Was there any fucking? And they're like, no. I'm like, so they like erase that shit. In fact, the only thing they show with that Raffi chick, who's not one of my favorite characters, I don't like her to be honest, but uh, the only thing they showed with her was her ex husband, her, her grandkids and shit. Like, they made her look completely heterosexual. There was no fucking mention of her. They're like, oh, but she was a lesbian because of season one and two. I'm like, I didn't watch that. Like, stop. I'm fucking people don't get it. It's like you're 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 co-signing. I'm like, I'm not. Uh do you, do you remember that rumor that was going around of uh Quentin Tarantino possibly do, doing a Star Trek movie? Yeah, yeah, that was dope. If you listen to his audio where he's just like, he disses JJ, he's like, no, just forget about all that. That's dumb. It doesn't make any sense. And then he goes on his like little rant. It's so glorious. I'm like, just give him Star Trek. I, I, I like I said, don't do Star Trek, but 100% would be more than down. I, I, would, I would be there midnight premiere. I know. Everyone would because it's freaking Tarantino. Yeah. I want to hear... Uh, you know Samuel Jackson come back, or or do a Star Trek movie, and they're they're cursing now. He can uh, say his famous word. The famous word. In, it's in Star, Trek. Star Trek. 
fucking say there it's too so many good. fucking tribbles on this motherfucking starship. Not that one, but <laughs> yeah, no, that's the one. That's the one. No, I to do is snakes on a plane fucking line, but with tribbles. That would be funny. 200 watt studio for five dollars says favorite part of Picard season three was the group think is bad theme. Yes. And then people online ironically berate you for liking it and thinking for yourself. I know it was there was a lot of irony going on. It's it's the like it was just like I'm arguing with people who didn't see it and they're like, no, what you saw is wrong. And I'm like, at least if you watched it, you could point it out and you had a real opinion. And I'd be like, all right, I can respect that. Like, I like when people watch a movie, both people watch it and they hate it. One hates it, one loves it. It's an argument. But when one person didn't see it at all and they're just telling you that you're wrong, it's like a little bit fucking a little it's money. Annoying. Yeah. All right, everybody. All right, everybody. Thank you, everybody in the chat. I'm going to wrap it up here. I got to pee and I got to go to sleep. There's no more gay butt stuff. You're not the boss of me. <laughs> Ow, grow. Hey, are you Cecil? Yeah. Hello. This is Cecil. I love you all. I want you to remember that you are very special to me, each in your own special way. Bye, everybody. Goodbye from the lighthouse. And I say good night. Anybody here? Okay.